There's nowhere to run once locked inside this hellacious structure. Oh, that'll knock the wind out of you. Oh, no. Wait a minute, Cole. What's he going to do here? Looking highly motivated here. That wild strike found nothing but empty air that time. <laughs> Man, that's what you call swinging for the fences and missing. Give me some thoughts on Stevens. You're talking about someone who has all the talent necessary to become one of the all-time greats. And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I can feel the breeze all the way over here. It's been well known for some time that Brock Lesnar does not discuss his private life. What we do know is he grew up on a farm in South Dakota and at every amateur level was a champion wrestler who dedicated himself to being pound for pound the best competitor that could be found in any ring. Oh, wait, nice reversal. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. He's absolutely relentless here. Oh, out of nowhere. That'll leave you gasping for air. Michael, you talked before about Brock Lesnar and how not much is known about his private life. Well, let me tell you something. That's how Brock Lesnar wants it. And I wouldn't recommend anyone trying to convince him to change his policy. We know what we need to know. Brock Lesnar's been a beast in wrestling rings practically his entire life. Oh, look at the emotion. This is the type of attack that just wears down an opponent. Yeah, and you can see it working right here. And that one hit with the force of a big rig. Thinking to avoid that. When you look at the private life of Brock Lesnar and the extent he goes to protect it, it's something that also helps him in the ring. How can you truly prepare for battle against someone if there's a point where you can't find anything else out about them? All we really know is his ability to eat, sleep, conquer, and repeat. You know, Michael, that's a great point. I've never really looked at it that way. Lesnar's privacy actually becomes an asset to him professionally. I mean, we know what we know. Brock's an uncontrollable force in the ring. His life revolves around the principle of eat, sleep, conquer, repeat. And, well, Brock's close friendship with that no-good moron, Paul Heyman. And I guess that says it all. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Wait! Is he still conscious? Man, that looked bad. We know what's coming here. It's the German suplex. The end is near. Right about that. Brock Lesnar's out to make an emphatic statement tonight. Somebody's going to get hurt in this match. Well, when the signature moves of Brock Lesnar become the topic, it's unavoidable that talk will turn to the power bomb. The beast has rattled the canvas with the body of just about every opponent who's caught oh by Stevens comes up big there. Yeah, Stevens looking for the W here. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Oh, out of nowhere. Remember, momentum in WWE can turn on a dime. And leave you some change. Going for an encore here. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. Lesnar has him up. F5 connects, and that has to be it. 
There it is, the finisher. This could all be over right now. Detroit has had the reputation for being an electric crowd, and the fans here in attendance tonight are indeed no different. Detroit has had the reputation for being an electric crowd, and the fans here in attendance tonight are indeed no different. It's devastating. This is hard to watch. This is going to be bad. There's some serious power right there. What we're witnessing here is surreal. The beast, Brock Lesnar, is lethal as is. But now it's like he's running on. And there's the triple German suplex. <gasps> Brock Lesnar says it ups and up. He's going to end this thing. And his opponent is about to take up residence in Suplex City. Wait, what the, hold on, now where's he going? Oh man, you hope when you see someone climb up there that they at least have a plan. This is where you need to look out. The wall of a WWE steel cage measures. He's nearing the floor yes. and his opponent can just look on. Oh, look at the emotion. Woo, a little showboating going on here. We need to be sure. What a tremendous victory.